Hello dear student welcome to my youtube channel in this video we will see uh, practical number one of computer application in pharmacy uh, so you will find all the videos related with that computer application uh, pharmacy practical so there are almost 12 practicals and you will find a playlist and uh, in the description box i have given the link of all the videos that i have designed so in this first practical we have to design a questionnaire using a word processing package to gather information about a particular database or particular we can say a disease uh, see this uh, word processing means ms word we will require uh, for collecting and data and how to gather that information in a form and how to design that form we will see in this video so i will show you the demo for a particular disease how to gather any information for that particular disease like the video and subscribe the channel for more updates uh, apart from this computer application in pharmacy most of the content from on my uh, youtube channel it is often come uh, it is of an organic chemistry as well as an analysis as well as an admission related most of the videos so that will be helpful in your future so subscribe the channel for more updates we are now on the desktop uh, actually i am in the folder but you can be on the desktop so press right on your mouse and you will find in the new microsoft word document uh, so this is the microsoft office and in that you will find the microsoft word document so double click on it you can re rename the document uh, whatever the document you will open you can rename it now this document it has been open uh, see this document it it will look in this way uh, microsoft office word document if you don't see this rulers on uh, top and bottom and side view so you can come in uh, view and in the view you can uh, press over here for ruler so already it has been ticked uh, so i can see if i remove it i cannot see it but it is good for an adjustment of a page so tick on it so you can adjust the page so the very first thing is that uh, i need to now gather some data what data it has been required for a patient information form so i will write a patient information form formation form and uh, so patient information form select it once you select it uh, so use this the font so i will use the uh, arial black because it is uh, a heading and i will make this font bigger so keep uh, align it in the center once you align it is in the center uh, after that write the particular so i will write here hiv patient so it is for a particular disease so i have mentioned hiv patient now after that i want some general information about a patient uh, so i will write uh, information patient information patient information i want to reduce the font and i want to align now so for that purpose i will select only this for uh, patient information and i will reduce it so i will reduce it to the 12 and i will align it uh, and after that i need some patient information so you can type it as it is but for an convenience what i will do is that i will uh, drag a table so from insert you take a table uh, so uh, required field you can put in it so i will take 4 by 4 and 6 okay. uh, so there are total Four, four columns so the first column is name of patient name of patient uh, so i will drag it later on after that h that is the next factor uh, i will write here date of birth date of birth and here i will write gender and here i will write address you can also add uh, some more field like what is his contact number uh, so you can add in the patient information 
so now these are bigger means uh, font size it is not so clear uh, so for that purpose i will go again in the home and i will remove this and i will take times new roman so you can take anything from it uh, and i need to adjust it for address see i look uh, i require a huge space so i will merge this select it and press left right key on your mouse and merge it so now it is ready uh, see this uh, name of patient it should have insufficient space so i will scroll it and i will more scroll it i can make it a bigger table so just select it and drag your mouse so name of patient it is now sufficient gender so here you can tick male female or trans gender so anything it can be also just tick on it whatever it it may be so for address i will give one more space because address it requires some more space uh, now i will type here test details details again i will require and a table so test details there will be only some few test details like uh, date of test after that test conducted at conducted at which hospital you have to mention it at which hospital uh, it was been conducted after that test done in last two years two years so it may be 1 2 3 4 5 anything it may be it will be in a numbers and the last question will be test conducted or test done till yet done till yet so it, uh, here again it may be a count here also it will be a count and uh, conducted at it may be an hospital or it may be a laboratory and at which date you were positive so uh, this it will come from a test report so again uh, choose a column and in the this uh, table you can change your font i will change it to times new roman and let it be at 12 only now in the third box i have already typed it that is a uh, possible mode of transmission see here in the test details you can see that it is aerial black 12 so i will make it aerial black 12 it is calibre body so i will make it aerial black 12 select the font size it will be 12 uh, see here i have given a, a written here in the bracket that tick relevant box so in this uh, like what is the mode of transmission hiv can be caused by only these four methods uh, sexual contact blood contamination needle or syringes if it is of an infected patient uh, after from uh, that mother to infant means from mother to baby and if patient does not know any of the cause uh, you can tick over here so tick what to tick uh, so for that purpose come uh, in this Uh, bullets uh, in the sub menu and here you can find out the arrow for tick so arrow for tick uh, now the problem with this is that uh, i cannot place that tick in the relevant box because it is an th uh, bullet so i cannot put over there for that purpose what we need to do is uh so come in an insert so in a insert a second menu bar you can see here a symbols so come in that symbols and come on the more symbols so already i have searched it uh, see this recently used symbol i have searched it so that is why i can see it uh, 
so in the font uh, you come on this wit jings uh, wit dings wink dings uh, so come on this win dings directly type this w or win dings and in the bottom at scroll this down and at the bottom you can you will see this uh, there are two such kind of boxes uh, so select this one and insert it and close it now you can see that uh, it is now available and if required further you can just copy it and utilize for further uh, any more table so this was the third table and i will now have the fourth table i will directly copy it for other complications now other complications like suppose he is having diabetes he is having blood pressure he is having alzheimer ulcer arthritis cancer or there may be an n numbers of n complications uh, so i will just uh, again copy this for tick in the relevant box if you are having any complications from uh, the given format if not uh, there is the fourth option so there can be an any other uh, complications so these are some complications common uh, if you are having any other complications then just tick over here and write below so here i have written spe please specify in the below box what complications you are having uh, so it may be any other like tb you might be having or any other complications that might be having and if you are having any complications uh, you might be having a uh, regular some medicines like in case of an uh, blood pressure and diabetes they are always having an regular medicines so which medicines uh, do the patient have so it will be uh, helpful for an further when medicament or the treatment it has been given by a physician so that will be helpful if any contraindicated medicine or uh, any other medicine that is in the regular so it can omit from an uh, hiv infected patient or uh, for a treatment or either a doctor can or a physician can change the medicine which may have an interaction in the body so now i have written here uh, point and regular medicine if patient is having some regular medicine he can uh, write over here who uh, so press shift and then near to the back backspace key you will find this key uh, if you are having any regular medicine press space you can write here the area it is to write and any regular medicine do you have and after that i will write here uh, date of visit when you visited this physician so the date of visit it should be written in ddmmyy so you can write it and after that checked by checked by a name of physician so there can be a number of physicians in the main hospital or uh, in the hospital and after that sign in sign of <coughs> sign of doctor or sign of physician so you can write that now here uh, why i was saying that you should have these rulers uh, see you can now drag it below so now uh, sign of doctor it, it is coming up by this way you can make a form so this is our form that we have prepared just i will show it once again a patient information firstly uh, what is the name of patient age date of birth gender address test of details so that has to be written by a uh, physician who is uh, doing a process a um, possible mode of transmission so he can interact with the patient and uh, tick on the relevant box if you don't know so there is one more option and if patient is having other complications so you can tick on the other complications whichever are relevant and if not then leave it not applicable say not applicable if he is having a regular medicine so write the regular medicine if not write not applicable date of visit you have to write in ttmmyy checked by a sign of doctor so you can make such kind of a form using this word microsoft word if you are having any doubt you can ask me in a comment box i will surely answer it thank you for watching the video